Hey guys, what's up? This is David Gracia from Slasher Mini Films. Um, I went to Goodwill recently and I picked some stuff up. Um, let me show you guys what I ended up picking up. Um, you guys saw my mint copy of The Downward Spiral, but I didn't get to explain what other CDs I picked up. I picked up two, and um, ended up picking up a copy of um, Octung Baby by U2. It came out in 1991, and it's a very underestimated album. Um, I actually find this to be one of my favorite U2 albums, only because of the fact that I seem to enjoy albums that people find crappiest. But whatever, you know. I don't care. Uh, and I ended up picking up a copy of um, Nine Inch Nails' original debut. Pretty Hate Machine. This is an original 1989 copy. It's pretty cool. Um, good condition. All these CDs were 206 piece. Um, I ended up picking up a um, CD player. This is made by Durabrand, which is or Duraband, which is usually sold at Walmart. This looks like it was was manufactured around. In fact, let me see if I can find a manufactured date on here. Sorry, guys, my sister's reading a book. Oh crap! And what do you know? The freaking um manufacture date was ripped off. I may be able to find out. Uh oh wait, oh wait, this was um manufactured in oh eight. Um, it's got a base boost switch on the back, which is kind of weird. Um, it does have an AM, FM receiver in it, which means I can pick up radio stations on this. Um, program, repeat, um, stop, slash off, uh, fast forward, slash skip track, um, uh, uh, rewind, slash backtrack, and then on and off. And it does indeed work. Let's check that out. And then a really cool find I ended up picking up was, um, I ended up picking up an Optimus, uh, an Optimus, uh, microcassette recorder. And then the first thing I thought of this when I picked it up was Saw, because if you remember the movie Saw, um, there were always these, and if you remember my review even, um, no, I didn't show them in the review, but, um, there were these little microcassettes that Jigsaw would place throughout there, so, whatever. It's pretty cool, and it actually looks like the one used. Um, and what was cool about this is it actually came with a set of three tapes. Huh. It's bizarre. Hold up a second, guys. In here. What? Crap. What's up? Oh, wow. Well, it turned out that the up here was to flip this flap here up and then over. That's lovely. Well, I'm doing a video and frankly, I am slightly creeped out and don't know what to do, so... I'm going to, might as well play this sucker um, in here. So maybe it means this side, All right. and it's that direction. So upside down there. Fits. All right, let's, let's see what this is all about. Oh, crap, not a game. Jeez, no. Okay. You must review a crappy game. No, I I only review good games. Just. I, yeah, you know what? Just shut up, okay? I've already got one for you to review. And trust me, it's not that good. That doesn't help me. What about it? See you in the next review. No, don't go. Tell me what the freaking game is. Now. I can't tell you that. It'll spoil the surprise. Just shut up about a stupid surprise. Tell me. I want to know the... You know what, just screw it. It's Bart vs. the Space Mutants. I'll see you in the next review. Oh, no. No, please, no. Why? Why Bart versus the Space Mutants? Why? 